The Honest Nana In a village named Kampung Hola Hola, there lived a girl named Nana with her mother Anmela. They are very close. They live in a little house down here. Anmela is a fruit seller at the market. Although they are poor, Anmela always advises Nina to be honest in everything she does. Anmela wants Nina to be a useful person in her life. Nina is a hardworking girl. She likes to help her mother selling fruits. During weekend, she will follow her mother to the market to help her. One fine Saturday morning, Nina follows her mother to the market as usual. On their way to the market, Nina sees a toy shop across the street. There are cute teddy bears in the shop. She likes the teddy bears very much. So, Nina asks her mother to buy them for her. However, they could not buy the teddy bears because they do not have enough money. One day at the market, Nina is helping her mother as usual. Suddenly, her mother has a headache and wants to rest. She leaves Nina selling the fruits by herself. Then, come the richest lady in the village, Madam Suzanne. Madam Suzanne stops by Nana's stalls. She buys few red apples for her son. Thank you, Nana, said Madam Suzanne. You are welcome, Madam. Please come again, replied Nana. After Madam Suzanne leaves the stall, she unfortunately does not notice that a few money has dropped from her bag. Nina found the money. She takes the money and said, Should I return the money to Madam Suzanne? Or should I use this money to buy the teddy bears? Hmm, I think I should buy the teddy bears because Mama would never buy them for me, said Nena. So, Nena walks and walks to the toy shop. On her way to the toy shop, she suddenly remembers Anmela's advice. Nena, you need to always be honest in your life. Nena regrets her decision. She goes back to the market to meet her mother. At the market, Nena tells her mother about the money. Her mother is very proud of Nena and does not scold her for her action. Then, Nena and her mother go to Madam Susan's house to return the money. Madam Susan, this is your money. You drop it in front of our stall. I almost used your money to buy teddy bears. Luckily, I remembered Mama's advice to always be honest. I am so sorry, Madam Suzanne, said Nina. Oh, my dear Nina, you are so kind and honest. Because of your honesty, I would like to give you some presents. Come, let's go to the toy shop, said Madam Suzanne. Madam Suzanne buys Nina the teddy bears that she really wants. Madam Suzanne also buys her some new clothes and candies. Nina is really happy and believes that we need to always be honest in our life. Me and Moral values of the story are 
We should be honest in everything we do. We should always help each other. And we should be generous.